Thanksgiving may be less than a week away, but for those of you looking to get in the spirit of Christmas, a local event is sure to inspire you. The Festival of Trees is underway. News 6 anchor insider guy Crystal Moyer explains how the event has been getting results for the community. Yes, ladies, proceeds from the event benefit art education programs at the Orlando Museum of Art. Volunteers from across Central Florida creating one-of-a-kind holiday decor, some getting inspiration from a recent trend. When it comes to Christmas trees, you're probably thinking bright red ornaments, snow-capped leaves, and lots of holly berries. But here at the Festival of Trees event inside the Orlando Museum of Art, the holiday spirit goes outside the box. The Barbie box. It's been a labor of love. Designer Lindsay Mattioni inspired by the popular film. The tree is, is situated like the movie. It starts out with the Barbie bow and then it goes to her little feathery shoes and it kind of works its way down with all the jewels and the, um, the silhouettes all the way down to the Birkenstocks at the bottom. Take a closer look. There are actual heels on this tree. A custom Barbie belt buckle, even jewelry inspired by the most iconic toy. All the items donated by local businesses. It's really women helping women helping the community, and that's something that um, I'm just so incredibly proud of, seeing it all being pulled together. This just one of more than 30 festive ferns throughout the museum, each one unique like this wolf pack tree, and they're all up for auction. One already donated to Orlando Regional Medical Center. A lot of our family and patients will be coming through, and especially being in a hospital around the holiday season, it's not ideal, but at least when they come in and see the tree itself and see all the holiday decorations throughout the lobby, it's nice to kind of take their mind off of what they may be going through at that moment in time. Festival of Trees is organized by Council of 101 to raise money for art education programs, with more than $14 million donated to the Orlando Museum of Art since 1965. I wouldn't be who I am today without art education. Um, I'm an interior designer, I'm a muralist. Those two things propelled me when I was younger and this is my way of wanting to give back and donate back to the community to help those, those little kids that you know, may have been in the same situation that I was in. The event also includes anything but ordinary holiday decor, like rosé on a wreath, dog ornaments, even something for owl lovers. There's also a gingerbread village with fun cookie creations, pop-up boutiques, and live entertainment to get you in the holiday spirit. The Festival of Trees is open to the public through Sunday at the Orlando Museum of Art. I posted ticket prices and special events as well as discount opportunities on clickorlando.com slash insider. Who would have known? Barbie tree. Barbie tree, <laughs> dog ornaments. I mean, I want to run there right now. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's so beautiful. And I feel like, you know, there's so much more. You probably couldn't even get to everything. Oh, that's no. Going there. There's just decor everywhere. And the unique thing is a lot of these uh, creators are artists. Mm -hmm. So it's not your typical Christmas decor. They are themed. There were some that was like um, travel themed, so it had little passports and okay. little areas around the world. So it's really cool to, to be able to see that and see just how your mind can go wild doing, you know, holiday decor. Fabulous. And the chance to take it home is so cool too. All right. Oh, some of that stuff is already already right. gone. Already <laughs> that barbie for. tree is gone. I'm sure it is. Keep that one up all year round. <laughs> yeah. Thank you, Crystal.